cool. <laughs> okay, so now we're going to meet another exciting person. He is uh, a photographer and uh, he is 23 years old. He actually just turned 23 today. Uh, and yeah. <laughs> <coughs> Uh, you all have to sing the birthday song when he comes on. <laughs> and uh, his work has been published in uh, numerous Norwegian newspapers. He's also been sent on assignments by um, the New York Times and Leica, just to mention some. Shurelien, uh, will you join me on stage? Yay! <laughs> Hi. <laughs> oh. Let's go to... Um, yeah. We're going to see some of your photos, but first, happy birthday. Thank you, thank you. Thank How you. does it feel to be <laughs> 23? Ah, uh, I'm getting old, <laughs> actually, so. I'm 27, so. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> happy birthday to you. I'm getting a bit embarrassed, <laughs> uh, but uh, one of the first pictures is uh, actually from a sect uh, deep in Siberia. Yeah, and uh, Marit Bjørgen uh, at uh, Holmecon two years ago, I think. Yeah, <laughs> soccer. <laughs> These are two people that I are really fond of. Um, they are Christina and Johanna, uh, who are two hunting twins up in uh, Troms. And what I love about my job is that I'm able to meet fantastic people like them, that uh, dare to be themselves. They don't uh, go out partying. They don't drink cappuccinos. They're not like the average teenage girls. So. Yeah. Yeah. And what was uh, your hello? <laughs> what was your like? What uh, the creative process before taking this picture? Did they just stand like that, or did you? I think like uh, when we first met them, uh, we traveled up to to Trumps, me and the journalist, and the first thing we saw was the old uh, Volvo 240 running up with a dead fox in the back. <laughs> And uh, both of the girls hanging out with their cigarettes. So I think like the picture only, it was quite easy to take actually. It was just having them there, having the two dogs, and trying to get everybody to look in the camera. Okay, <laughs> cool. But how did you know, how do you know when you take a picture and you think, ah, th how did you know that, when was the moment when you, how was the moment when you thought, <laughs> ah, this is the one? Like, the, uh, this was the last pictures we took that day. So before this, we had been out uh, trying to hunt and to fish, so, and everything led up to this moment when we need to capture uh, the whole uh, of the persons in one, one scene. And uh, when we got it, just, it was just really, really cool. Mm. And you actually got, got a pro uh, first prize uh, on the Picture of the Year award yeah, in Norway? Yeah, uh, it was awarded uh, first prize uh, in Portrait Picture of the Year. So uh, that was, of course, fun, but uh, it was much more fun to meet them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> cool. I actually live with vegans, so they kind of hate this <laughs> picture. <laughs> they're against, uh, you know, you know vegans. They don't even eat. Oh, uh, yeah, cheese. Yeah, nothing. Almost. Yeah, oh, nothing. Oh, no. Yeah, but they, uh, you know, they know how to cook <laughs> pizza and yeah. stuff. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is a quite different picture. Um, this was taken on July 22nd, as you might imagine. Um, so, like, my job is very uh, uh, broad. You, I get to do. <laughs> Uh, almost everything. So uh, I was working at uh, VG, uh, where I do most of my work, uh, when the bomb went off. So when the 
um, the windows in my or our office blew in. Um, the building was beginning to uh, evacuate. So uh, we were, I think, two, two or three photographers at uh, uh, at work at that time. So we grabbed our camera gear and uh, well, began shooting. Mm. So that was like the first thing for me instinctively to, to do. Okay. But how do you keep calm in a situation like that? I'm not sure, but I think uh, I almost went on like automatic uh, because uh, when I ran out, everybody was getting first aid and for me it was a natural thing to try to document and show the horror of this terrorist act to mm -hmm. the people. So that was the only thing that was natural to me yeah. at that time, yeah. Okay, and this? Uh, this is from a Burmese uh, monk in Burma last year, uh, where I spent four weeks uh, doing a story on the on the, the monks who were fighting for democracy. Mm. And the same uh, Ansang Suu Kyi, uh, Burma last year. And uh, just the last photo from uh, Boston, uh, the Boston bombings. Um, two weeks ago, three weeks ago, yeah. Okay, and that was it. it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thank you.